Hello, I'm Dr. Sunanda Kane. I'm a professor of medicine at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. We're going to spend a few minutes talking about ulcerative colitis and the implications of treatment. So a lot of patients with ulcerative colitis end up on therapies that carry a lot more risk and expense like Humira or Remicade and they wonder whether they really need these therapies and if they're doing any good and whether when their doctor may or may not be changing their medicines around that it's of help. So there's a new study that just got published from the University of California at San Diego and the investigators there followed patients with ulcerative colitis who were on either Humira or Remicade and we're actually able to show over a year's time that with repeated scopes and with adjustments of their therapy that they could actually achieve healing of the colon with those medicines. And so what does that mean? So that if you have active ulcerative colitis and you've been put on one of these medicines and you're feeling better, that's terrific. But what we're now shooting for is for your colon to actually look healed. And the only way we're going to know that is with another endoscopy and patients don't necessarily want to go through an endoscopy but we've been able to now show in a more systematic fashion that it makes sense that if we are following what your colon looks like and make dose adjustments based on what your colon looks like that we can actually achieve this really important endpoint.